So uh, bottled water versus tap water. This is always a fun topic. I always find it fascinating when I come across people that like, oh, I don't trust the tap water. I only drink bottled water. And that frustrates me because it, it comes from a position of not knowing uh, the facts involved. So we're going to look at that. We're going to look at a, a several different things. And uh, I think by the end of the day, you'll realize it's probably not only is it a cheaper, uh, more responsible for the environment, but it's also safer to drink tap water. Um, so why is there bottled water in the first place? Well, back in the 1990s, soft drink companies started to move away from sugared drinks. Uh, they started putting water in bottles and marketing it. That's just the crazy thing. Um, a lot of the wa bottled water in the United States starts off as tap water. Uh, they might filter it, add something to change the flavor, but um, a lot of it starts off as tap water. 14.4 uh, billion gallons of bottled water were sold in the United States last year. That's an amazing amount of water. Sales reached $36.6 .6 billion last year. So it's a multi-billion dollar industry. Um, for taking something that is almost free and putting it in a bottle. So it, it's an amazing phenomenon that has occurred. It's become almost a status symbol in some in some cases where people drink bottled water because it's sort of cool to drink. Um, the marketing that's out there is talking about how important it is to drink water, so drink so many bottles of water a day. And so you get a lot of this information out there that is just, uh, it, you know, it's just marketing to get people to drink water from bottles. Um, as we go on today, hopefully you'll see that's not necessarily a, um, a good idea. Matter of fact, I'd say it's a bad idea. So again, I mentioned we're gonna talk about taste, cost, um, we'll spend more time on the environment, and then a lot of time on the quality of the water, looking at some case studies as well. So taste, a lot of people complain that uh, the taste of bottled water is so much better than tap water. There's a uh, Penn and Teller video that you can find on YouTube, I would show up, but we don't have the technology to do that right now. It just doesn't work on our version of web of GoToWebinar. So I'd encourage you to go to YouTube, look up the Penn & Teller uh, bottled water. And basically what happens is they go to a restaurant, I think it's in New York, and they make a bunch of fancy bottles. They fill them all up from the hose at the back of the restaurant, and they have a, um, a bottled water waiter who comes out and says, oh, there's bottled water, you know, this fancy bottled water or this fancy bottled water. People buy the bottled water for up to like, I think it's seven or $8 a bottle. And it gets their opinions of how much, oh, uh, this water, this water is obviously much better than that water. This water is very, very clear, very fresh. It makes me feel, you know, it's very natural. And they go through this whole thing and it's just, it's, it's, it's sort of, it's just hilarious. It's a funny video um, just showing how people, oh, it's in a bottle, so it must be better. That sort of seems to be the attitude that I encourage you to get that video. There's a link in the uh, reading list. It's just a funny video. So it's, it's probably five, seven minutes. Um, wish I could show it now, but uh, I'll just encourage you to go watch that on YouTube. Uh, in, blind in blind taste tests, tap water consistently scores the same or better than bottled water. The funny thing is when the tests are not blind, people say bottled water tastes better. But when they're blind taste tests, they don't know the difference. They say uh, tap water tastes either better or the same as bottled water. It's sort of interesting. Uh, one test done included New York City tap water, Poland Springs, uh, O2 water, Evian. And New York City tap water received the highest scores, um, getting 45% of the vote. The next closest getting with 24% of the vote. So. And that's New York City, so I don't know. Uh, we do that here in Los Angeles regularly where LA DWP water consistently scores the highest. Again, people taking testing, uh, tasting tap water versus bottled water and it ends up being the tap water wins out. So uh, taste is, although people say taste is an issue, it's not really an issue. Uh, one thing's interesting, a lot of people complain because they think it tastes like chlorine and there is chlorine residual in the tap water. That's an EPA requirement uh, for the health of the people that are drinking the water to make sure it keeps any uh, bacteria out of the water. Uh, one thing you can do, get a pitcher of water, let it stand for a couple hours and the chlorine will evaporate. And um, you know, people drink that water and just comment about, oh, this is really good water. Where'd you get this water? It's like, no, it's just tap water. But if you let it stand for a little bit, the chlorine will evaporate and it'll taste different. So uh, that's an option. If you want to uh, serve water to, to your uh, guests, once you're allowed to have guests in the home again, uh, just let the, the pitcher sit out for a couple hours and 
the chlorine residual will evaporate and uh, the water will taste fine. So cost, just a brief thing, what can I say? Uh, bottled water can be up to 2000 times as expensive as tap water. That is just amazing. Again, I mentioned bottled water sales uh, reached $34.6 billion in 2019. And the average person consumes 43.7 gallons of bottled water. Um, they did last year, at least. Tap water on the average is about uh, 0.4 cents per gallon. So if you think about how much a bottle of water costs, if you go to the store and get a bottle of water for $1.50 for, even if it's a quart, you're talking six bucks, um, you can get a gallon of tap water for only point, uh, 0.4 cents, as opposed to paying a lot more for bottled water. So um, bottled water and costs. Uh, those are issues that come up. They're issues that are, you know, taste is one of the things you, you hear a complaint about a lot. Um, but I think people, if they realize how much money they are spending on bottled water every year, it becomes sort of a, a big deal. Uh, but a couple of things that are more important is one is the environment. And um, 